What is up everyone, this is Super Yarame and welcome to the episode number 11 of my Grimsby Tank career mode in FIFA 17. We are still in the transfer window, it's August 5th, we have Millwall to play and I was thinking and I think I still need some squad depth. I'm weak at my right back options because of course we have the one and only Thiago but then we have Mills who is 51 rated and he's just not good enough. Uh, center backs only have four which is also not good enough. We only have two strikers, we need some more squad depth. Okay guys, I have decided that I'm going to simulate those pre- uh, not pre-season games that be, that are not in the- that are still in the transfer window, and we actually got a 2-1-0 win. Thiago scores our first goal in League 1. We got some transfer after the first one being for James McKeon. Do we want to sell him? I would let him go for 250k if I'm honest. And then I thought, we, I think we have for Ren and Adelaide. Yes, indeed. Um, no, I'm not going to sell him. Okay, good news. Maximilian Mittelstedt has accepted his contract. Okay, guys, we have Wimbledon here in the EFL Cup. Not too worried about this cup. Um, just gonna sum it with my second team. We actually do win 3 to 2. Andrew, Brown, and Chambers. Uh, Exeter are back with a new offer for McKeon. Um, 220, and like, I can let him go. Another transfer offer for James McKeon. I would want over 200 for him. Okay, guys, we have Fleetwood Town this time around. Also going to simulate the game. Just want to get through this transfer window as soon as possible. 2 2, it's not right result. Mitchell though, is injured. Ah, uh, sorry, got a red card. One. Squad training time it is, and Spittlestedt and Bernard are both going One. up in ratings. Okay, we got back from Extra City, they want to give me 170... 200, come on, 200 for McKeon and I can let him go. Not transfer for James McKeon, this time from AFC Wimbledon. 210, I would let him go. Knots are bad, ooh! Do they have lots of money or what? <laughs> they came with a decent offer. 230k would be nice for him, Knotts. Knotts County came with 220k for James McKeon. I will let him go. Have AFC Wimbledon away. I'm going to simulate it. Maybe not the best of ideas. Because I don't think I will win it, but still. Oh, we got a 1 1 draw, which is decent. Okay, guys, we have sold James McKeon to Knotts County. Only 140 to our budget. Well, okay, now we do need to sign a new goalkeeper. And with James McKeon departing, Etheridge can get the number one. Okay guys, I'm going to sign a better scout, and it's Jarno Talvela from Finland. And I'm going to send him to Slovenia to find me some new good young players. Hopefully he finds something good, and also going to bring this fanning guy to let's say England, yeah why not, um, also for 9 months, let's put him there. We have Brighton now in the EFL Cup, I'm pretty sure we're gonna lose this game, not too stressed about it, 4-0, we get hammered. We have Southend United, going to simulate of course, I really want to make one signing I think more. We get, whoa, 3-0, boys though gets a red card. Okay guys, so we'll be trying to get Silvan Vailati on a one-year loan. Um, hopefully they'll accept it. Also, Olusanya, I'll try to get him on a one-year loan. Okay guys, I was actually pretty impressed with Caden Jackson last year. I'll be trying to sign him up actually uh, for 100k. Hopefully they'll accept it. We have Leighton Orient in the Czech Trade Trophy. Can we win it? No, we can't. Barnsley would want 200 for Jackson. It's a bit too much. 140 maybe? AFC Wimbledon. No, yeah. AFC Wimbledon accepted my offer for Toyushi Olusanya. Try to bring him. Uh, he welcome to the team. Uh, and Vailati, the right back, is also coming to our team. Sean Pearson is up for two months. That is not good. Okay, guys, one more player I do want to bring to the team is Jordan Williams for a one year loan. Let's see if they will accept that. Okay guys, I have just found out I can't do that. Because I need to keep my balance in the right place for finances. So I can't do that. Which means that basically this is going to be the end of our 
signing of any players because we don't have we have to um, make our budget right because otherwise our our objective will not be made okay guys this is the squad by the looks of it that will try to do some damage in this year's at least until January we don't have the second goalkeeper, which is probably not the best thing, but I'll be trying to sum some sign someone up from the Youth Academy. We'll see how it goes with that. Let's complete now the transfer window. Uh, Oblak is the highest one. 82.5 million from Atletico Madrid to Arsenal. Are you serious? I just missed for... What, what has happened? Youth facilities, are you serious? This freaking costs me the objective. Okay guys, I'm going to play this game against Coventry now. Let's go. Okay guys, this is the squad. We have Bernard, Bogle, Colette up top, Ren Adelaide in number 10, Barrett and Butcher behind. Then we have Thiago, Boyce, Jones, Mittelstedt with Etheridge and goal. On the bench are Gowling, Andrew, Summerfield, McAllister, Chambers, Disley and Brown. Let's go. Bogle it goes. Omar Bogle. Bogle. Can we shoot? Bogle. Rebound. Colette scores! We are leading 1-0 and Colette is scored our first goal when I'm playing in champ uh, in League 2, not in Championship, in League 2. The first goal of course was scored by Thiago, but when I'm playing, Colette is the first scorer. Great job, we're leading 1-0. No, no, Reed scores, bad defending and we are level, it's 1-1. Here we go guys, it's 1-1 at halftime, it started very lively and good for us, but then it went boring. It ended 1-1, we're playing good football, but no luck for squad training, let's see what happens. We get two players up, Bernard and Ren Adelaide. Dan Jones wants a bigger contract. Let's give the contract to him. They're going to be an important first team player. Going to simulate this game against Gillingham. Um, I'm not sure I'm simulating all the home games. But still, we do get a 2 1 win. Ah, oh, Thiago is injured. Please don't say it's for long. Ah, oh, shit. Thiago Abro is out for two fucking months. That is very, 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 very bad, but we'll have to work with it, um, that's not good, let's just do this training now, and hoping for more luck here, we get pretty bad results. Dan Jones also said he wants a bigger role in our squad, okay, crucial first time player it is. Okay guys, we're going to end the episode right over here, we are currently fourth in the table, just two points behind Rotherham United. Uh, which is pretty decent in my opinion. Now, I hope you did enjoy this episode. If you did, make sure to do all the good stuff. And until next time, peace.